Yeah, this is my uncle, Steve King. He was a really big inspiration to me growing up. My dad's brother, he played at uh, the University of Michigan, graduated in 96. So he was always around early on throughout my football career. He was always there. My girlfriend actually got me this last year. He had passed away five, six years ago. So I wear this under my pads uh, every game. You know, he was the original 27, so that's, that's why I wear uh, number 27 now. So, you know, I just like to honor him every time I step on the field. We were never on the same team. We're four years apart, so we never really got to experience as I went to high school. He was in going to middle school, and he went to high school, then I was going to college. So we never were on the same team together. So being able to bring what we did to the backyard, to the kids in the neighborhood, now to national stage, it's pretty cool. It's an honor. Why is it? It's motivation. Like I said before, he keeps me sharp. You know, I love him. I'm Batman, he rob him. For me, you know, the biggest thing he provided was kind of that inspiration of Hey, like this is a kid from a very small town in Kentucky who became the number one recruit in high school, balled out at the University of Kentucky, and then was the number one overall draft pick and played six or seven years in the NFL. And it was a constant reminder to me that like, you can do this too. I think that more so than advice that they gave me, but just they showed me what work ethic looks like and they showed me what it means to like really devote yourself to something. And so from my dad and my grandfather, watching them and, and the way that they carry themselves, the way that they treated people growing up, I think that's, that'd be the biggest thing I learned from them.